This wretched mountain will be the death of me. I'm freezing out here. Oh, splendid. More fodder for the mountain. I suppose that means we're gonna make another attempt to reach that wretched summit. Go present yourself to my lady. She should be on her way down the trail any moment. This is Sorrow. Half name, don't you think? The House of Orsama Glories in Orsinium engaged my lady's services to find the shrine of Tora Groigron. It supposedly waits at the snowy top. Only if you consider vile beasts, freezing winds, and falling ice to be a problem. We tried to climb the mountain three times now, and each failure was more spectacular than the last. If you're interested, Lady Laurent could really use the help. This expedition has really proved to be more troublesome than Lady Laurent anticipated. I hate to say it, but I think this time Sorrow might be more than she bargained for. Famous treasure hunter. I'm sure you've heard of her. We travel the land searching for hidden treasures, secret relics, and uh, other mystical things. I'm not at liberty to tell you much about our work, but it's very important. The House of Orsamer Glories. It's Orsinium's fledgling museum. They hired experts like my lady to scour the countryside for ancient relics related to Rothgar's history. To display them. Instant culture for the tourists, you see. Legends claim that a powerful relic was buried with Orsinium's founder. At Torag's shrine, my lady hopes to find the armlet of Torag. The bracelet that gave him the power. Karsten works for the museum and has been serving as our liaison and cultural expert. It has become clear that he and my lady disagree about a great many things. He's really beginning to try Lady Laurent's patience, I'm afraid to say. This one does not mind the cold. It keeps...
you curse then? How am I supposed to make a great discovery when you... Oh, hello! <laughs> Are you at the house of gory details? The Gorious Orcs? The... Oh, you know what I mean. The Orc Museum! Have you brought the extra help? Just you. Well, I was hoping for porters and guides and all, but I suppose that I can make do. I'll need to make a few slight adjustments to my plan, but this time we'll reach the Summit of Sorrow, I'm sure of it. <sighs> the last three times, you mean. We set up one camp, but the harpies and the icy wind cut us down each time we climbed higher. A few orcs even wandered into a chasm because they couldn't see more than two paces ahead in the fog. Ooh, it all upset me. To start, head up and present yourself to Karsten while I go check on my lazy manservant, Stibbons. We'll meet you up there. Uh, and remind Karsten who it is that's actually in charge of this expedition. He can be so uncooperative. Uh, why are you still here? Do you need directions or something? We're not just talking about any dead orc. This is Tarig Shrine. Not only was he the founder of the original city of Orsinium, but he was the owner of the armlet of Tarig. Do you know how high my reputation will soar once I recover that relic? According to a scroll fragment I studied, the armlet of Tarig is a magical bracelet encrusted with gems. With its power, Tarig was able to tame the savage wilderness. It allowed the ancient orcs to establish the first city of Orsinium. The museum in Orsinium has it on display. It only contains a few words in the ancient orc tongue, but I was able to make some sense out of it. It talked about the armlet, the shrine, and something called Sorrow's Kiss. Oh, doesn't that sound romantic? <laughs>